The ongoing Israel-Hamas conflict is largely a regional issue, not a global standoff. Its localized nature significantly reduces the potential for worldwide involvement. The international community is tirelessly working to mediate peace between the parties. These efforts are crucial in preventing the situation from escalating further. The existence of nuclear weapons serves as a powerful deterrent against the escalation of regional conflicts into global wars. In our era of globalization, economies are deeply interconnected. Global powers have vested economic interests in maintaining stability, which discourages escalation. Military alliances such as NATO have no direct implication in this conflict, reducing the chances of a multinational military response. The United Nations plays a significant role in peacekeeping and conflict resolution, serving as a potent barrier to escalation. Many countries maintain diplomatic relations with both Israel and Palestine, facilitating dialogue and negotiation. The absence of widespread mutual defense treaties means there's no obligation for global powers to intervene militarily. The conflict does not represent a direct confrontation between nuclear superpowers like the USA and Russia, reducing the risk of a full-scale war. War fatigue is another factor. The global community is generally weary of war, especially following recent conflicts in the Middle East. This sentiment acts as a deterrent against escalation. Advanced defense systems, such as Israel's Iron Dome, can also mitigate the risk of escalation by intercepting projectiles. The global war on terror has created a consensus against allowing terrorist organizations to provoke large-scale wars. International law, with its principles encouraging the resolution of disputes through peaceful means, also plays a role in preventing escalation. Public opinion worldwide exerts significant pressure against the escalation of conflicts into full-scale wars. Modern media coverage and scrutiny act as a deterrent against escalation, as do the threat of economic sanctions. Conflicts are increasingly fought in the cyber realm, which does not typically escalate to world wars. Ongoing global health challenges, like the COVID-19 pandemic, shift focus away from conflict and towards cooperation. Energy interdependencies, particularly the reliance of many nations on Middle Eastern oil, create a vested interest in regional stability. Lastly, cultural diplomacy and exchanges foster understanding and reduce the likelihood of escalated conflict. In conclusion, these 20 points reflect the complex interplay of regional dynamics, global interests, and the multifaceted efforts at conflict resolution. Combined, they present a compelling case against the escalation of the Israel-Hamas conflict into a global conflagration. Despite the severity and complexity of the situation, the prospect of it sparking a third world war remains unlikely.